school, the sixth grader, Jonathan. Jonathan was enrolled in one of our remediation math classes. As he practiced and mastered math skills, he entered in his own scores into the tool. I was in the classroom when Jonathan was taking a multiplication assessment on that quiz, and I saw him score 55% on it. But instead of entering in his own score, he refreshed the quiz to take it again. So I stopped him and I asked him, honey, why didn't you put in your score? His response to me, I can do better than that. I'm not putting in that score. I can do better. <laughs> this is a student who has struggled in math his entire academic career. Instead of just going through the motions and trying to move on, he went back for mastery on his own. We can all imagine this exact scenario going a totally different direction. Had the teacher handed a struggling student a piece of paper with a 55% on it, she very likely would have shrugged her shoulders and thought to herself, mm, I guess I'm just a 55% student. For Jonathan, the simple act of typing in his own score transformed his mindset. Instead of school being done to him, he understood that his scores, these numbers, belonged to him and to no one else. And he was in full control to change them. The teacher had an incredibly powerful tool at her fingertips as well. So she simply asked her students to enter in their scores on all different tools she was using in the classroom. And when she looked at her dashboard, for the first time ever, she could get mastery level data all in one place. She could use that information to adjust her instruction on a daily basis, or even within the period, to make sure she was responding to student needs. And with Zone to Grow's data verification process, she had full confidence that the student entered data was correct. And Jonathan actually did get 85%. Let me take it again, by the way. My co-founder, Dennis, and I have worked in districts and schools like yours, and we know how easy it is for terms like student ownership, data-driven instruction, growth mindset to roll off the tongue. And we know how hard it is to make those ideas a reality in the classroom. Students who use So to Grow show significant shifts in mindset compared to those who do not use it. When we surveyed students who use and compared them to those who don't, we saw pretty incredible things. Far more of them said they try their hardest to get good grades, and this is after using the tool for just a few weeks. They said, far more said they set goals for their own learning. And far more said they have the power to determine their own grades. So my ask of you today is this. Think of students you know, like Jonathan. Students who have never been in the driver's seat of their own education. Think of what we all can do for them together. True student ownership real-time data to inform instruction, growth and mastery, and mindset. Come talk to us. We're in the room right next door, and we can help you get started today for free. Thank you.